All right, guys, I hope you're all doing well. It's your boy Rami over here. I'm making a video today talking about being kind in a cruel world. Let's be real. We've all heard the saying that it's a cruel world out there, and it really is. There are good moments, but when you take a look at the big picture, there's a lot of hardship, trials, difficulties, challenges, and cruelty out there in the world. And unfortunately, a lot of that cruelty comes from us from human beings. Some people are just kind spirited and kind natured in this world. And usually you could tell them, you could tell who they are because they're a gem, they're a diamond, they're rare in this world. When someone is actually legitimately kind hearted, people know, <laughs> people can see it, people can smell it, people can, people just know if you're a kind hearted individual. Now, I consider myself a good-hearted person, um, especially how I was raised and how I've grown up. I've really been through a lot of things and um, I've always been generally a kind person to people around me. But, you know, throughout the years, I've noticed how being kind has really not benefited me in any way, shape or form. It hasn't given me any respect. <sighs> My advice to you is it's a bad idea to be kind-hearted in a cruel world. It's a very bad idea because there's no benefit that comes out of it. And I've learned throughout the years that if you wear your kindness on your sleeve, if you let the world know that you're a kind hearted individual, it's not going to end well for you. So my advice is to anybody that is kind hearted or kind spirited, first of all, there's nothing wrong with you. God bless you. We're actually meant to be kind to each other. God commands us to be kind. We're meant to be kind. It's not strange. It's not weak. It's not unusual. Humanity is meant to be kind to each other. The only problem is when you are kind natured and kind hearted, you are usually the deliverer of kindness and you're very rarely the recipient of kindness. Okay. And that shit is draining throughout the years. When you just see disappointment after disappointment, when you see that people are using you, when you see that you're not appreciated or respected, you become more thicker skinned later on in life. And uh, it's a very tough battle, that whole process of basically having to hide your kindness, having to conceal your kindness, especially when it's a part of your nature, when it's your everyday nature, it is difficult for you. To, to challenge that and to fight that. But that is my recommendation to you out there. If you are a kind hearted person, don't let the world see it. Basically is what I'm saying. You could still be kind. Absolutely. But you need to be selective on when to pull the kind card out. It cannot be out 24 seven. It cannot because it will not end well for you. So if you're someone that's within that boat and trust me, it's someone that I once was that was consistently kind and really put it on his sleeve and let the world know and see it, please learn from me. There are so many tragedies that happen within that time frame when you finally wake up and you realize that the world is cruel. The world is not kind. You are kind. You are doing the right thing, but it doesn't mean that everybody else will. And at the end of the day, you need to protect yourself. You need to protect yourself. Yeah, from the cruel world, you can't allow yourself to be an open target. And one of the easiest ways to become an open target in this cruel world is to publicly show and display your kindness for it to be well known that you're kind for you to have a reputation of being kind. No, 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 no. You can most definitely still be a very good person without displaying your kindness to everybody every day. As I said, not everyone deserves your kindness, not in this day and age, not in this world. It's the sad reality that we live in. It would be beautiful if you could be kind to everybody and everybody was kind to you, but <laughs> who are you kidding? That ain't happening. Okay. So my advice to you is from somebody that has been bullied throughout a lot of his life, somebody that has not had his kindness appreciated, somebody that you know, sent off his kindness to everybody and barely got it back, please protect yourself. You need to put yourself first because if you put yourself last in this world, I mean, people will only treat you how you treat yourself. 
when they see that you're out here running the race, doing everything for everybody else, people pleasing to the maximum, and then you're not catering for your own needs, you're not being that little bit selfish, which you need to be, then people won't respect you. Let me tell you something about human nature. Even though I consider myself kind, there are people out there that are way kinder, that are way, way kinder than me. And you know what happened? <laughs> when these people were exposing their kindness to me, I started to take advantage of them. I swear to God, and that is, again, that is not who I consider myself to be. That is not my nature, but that is human nature. Okay? Even kind people will take advantage of people that are kinder than them. You know, kindness... To me, kindness is a strength and it comes from God and it's something that is amazing that we should be doing for each other. But unfortunately, not everybody deserves your kindness. And when people mistake your kindness for weakness, they walk all over you like a mat. You know, you don't want to be anybody's walking mat, do you? So please restrain yourself from displaying your kindness to everybody. Do not build a reputation of being kind and only kind, okay? Sometimes it's okay to sway a little bit, to be unpredictable. So people can't really pinpoint who you are or what you're like. You have your kind moments, but you could also be a bit of an asshole. That's okay. That is okay. I've seen, I've seen Rami do something really nice, but I've also seen him be a bit crazy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm hard to read. That's how you should be, guys. Hard to read. Do not be so easy to read. Do not be so open to being kind. Do not wear it on your sleeve. Tuck it in. Hide it. Bring it out once in a while to those that deserve it. Okay? And remember, this is not a PSA to stop being kind. I think it's a beautiful thing. And I think you're a beautiful person. But I want you to look after you. And I want you to get something good out of it as well okay thank you so much guys for watching my video i really appreciate it and i'm doing quite well lately i'm feeling really good um i'm feeling a lot more aligned lately just mentally so thank you guys for those that check in and watch my videos i will be uploading more soon peace and love to everybody we'll speak soon